A lot of viewers seem to have confusions between Shein Stokes pattern and Biot's breathing pattern. These two are very common and often confused. So let's compare them together very quickly and learn the differences. The presence of either of these breathing patterns is indicative of a serious life-threatening condition. Shein Stokes pattern are seen in patients who are having cardiac damage, most commonly myocardial infarction or angina. Shein Stokes pattern is described as a period of increasing then decreasing breathing followed and preceded by a period of apnea. And it goes something like this. Biot's breathing pattern is seen in patients with brain damage. Anything that would damage the brain, think strokes, infections, or trauma. We know that the breathing center is in the brain, and if the brain is damaged, the breathing center will also be damaged. And so, the brain and the respiratory center will not send signals to the breathing muscles like the diaphragm to contract. So these patients will simply not breathe. But as time goes on, more and more carbon dioxide will build up in the blood and the very high levels of carbon dioxide will trigger the breathing center. This causes the brain to send rapidly a lot of signals to the breathing muscles and so the patient will breathe very heavily very quickly. Soon after, all of this breathing will result in decreasing carbon dioxide level and so the breathing center will again be inhibited. So Biot's breathing pattern is described as hyperventilation preceded and followed by a period of apnea. And it goes something like this. And to memorize everything simply, I put all the information in just one page so you can take a screenshot or something and you can memorize them whenever you want. Alright guys, that's all I have. Thank you so much for watching and hopefully this helps.